mix today. Next step is foundation, and today I'm using my True Match Lumi by L'Oreal. I'm also going to use a damp beauty blender sponge with a little bit of setting spray sprayed on. I'm now going to dab the foundation onto my skin and blend out. Gotcha Covered and my IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Under Eye. The NYX Cosmetics Concealer is for my problem areas that I have right now. It's closer to my skin tone. And then the Bye Bye Under Eye is going to be to do some highlighting and covering my dark circles. shade here is 13. I'm going to take this with a large shader brush and just begin to um, set our paint pot that we have already applied so that the rest of our shadows can blend seamlessly into it. Next taking Combust, I am going to begin deepening our crease and just kind of giving a nice transition color. Domed 
shader brush. I am going to kind of extend my crease here, um, giving it a wider eyed effect, I guess. <laughs> this is just going to make the eyes look a little bit bigger. I'm going right underneath the inner portion of my brow and then coming over into our outer V. shades here and I am going to begin to highlight. I'm actually not even going to apply a blush today. I just really liked uh, the look with the pink being focused on my lids and my mouth and just having a really decent highlight happening. And of course we highlight the tip of the nose in the cupid's bow. And now I am going to apply dull parts also to my lips. Uh, finishing spray by NYX. 
and that's it ladies i really hope you enjoyed this makeup look don't forget to um, like and subscribe all of my social media links of course as always are going to be down below i hope that you guys are enjoying my videos lately and thank you so much for joining me each week i love all of you my foxy foxy family i love you please stay weird please love makeup and i'll see you soon <laughs> bye guys <laughs> Today I'm going to be doing this rustic, grungy, rose makeup look for you guys. I hope that you guys like this. It's a little bit outside of the box for me because I usually 